All Close right, Ping's up next. Yeah, he's going to be here in just a minute right after this very special phone mm. call he's on. We'll let you know what this is all about. Big Coming news. up after the break. Stick with us. <laughs> you look Good. great for 70. Oh, yeah. Happy <laughs> birthday, big guy. <laughs> you know, I'm... <laughs> Do you, are you guys up to something about my birthday? Never. Tell, did you know it was my I birthday? I did. You, you did? did? And you didn't say anything! <laughs> <laughs> you just didn't want to be that guy. Like Don't on Facebook, it. everybody says, happy birthday. So the second worst team in the league, the Magic, with 12 straight road losses and counting. Came home tonight in Amway Center to play just an average Detroit team. Now, last night I said they would win. My buddy, the old Magic head coach, Stan Van Gundy, didn't say it, but when asked by me, he did Man, this. Hey, do you think your old uh, franchise is going to win them? Oh, Stan says they're not winning. <laughs> Oh, Steve, what does he know about the NBA and the Magic? Tommy, Detroit goes down tonight. Love it. A flalo through the middle, no defense for the Pistons. And look at the block there. Kylo Quinn, six block shots tonight. Oladipo off the bench, 20 points. The Magic, they win at home. They love home cooking, right, Matt? Oh, yeah. 112, 98 the final. No question, I am very tough in this Magic team when they play well. I'll tell you what they did tonight. They're still great at one thing, this. It's time for the magic cliche of the night. Uh, one person stepped up and everyone else kind of uh, hopped on board after that. Another riveting magic cliche of the night. Oh, man. <laughs> Look at what we have here. Birthday, Did Lisa put you up to this? Who did? I wish I could say Shades from friend. the Orlando Solar Bears, minor league hockey at Amway Center. You got a game tomorrow and you brought me a cake. You baked that cake? Playing Gwinnett, right? Now... And thanks for coming, and I appreciate that. Thanks, Lisa. All right, now, <laughs> you know, my mom's interview. birthday today, this is a special day. This is what this special phone call was all about I was just making. She's on the phone. I think she's a little nervous. Mom, it's oh. a beautiful thing. We share the same birthday. What's the day been like for you? Don't be nervous. Well, it's wonderful, David, having our son born on my birthday. Uh, we've enjoyed that through the years, and we can't say how many years, but <laughs> happy birthday to you, son. Happy birthday, Mom. I love you. I love you, too, David. Have uh, a good day. Look at Mom. Give her some music again. Happy. How about my mom? It's her birthday. Happy birthday. Well, we won't tell her, tell everybody exactly what the year was, though. All right. High school student athletes today, part of National <laughs> Signing Day. It's when seniors in all sports sign their name to a piece of paper officially committing to the college of their choice. Football, right, dominates the day. Now, according to all the experts, FSU third in the recruiting class, the Gators ranked sixth, UCF ranked second in the American Conference. No question that uh, everywhere we went, everybody was upbeat and, uh, you know, high on UCF. All right, Coach O'Leary, all right. He loves Solar Bears hockey. I guarantee it, Shades. <laughs> Do not forget, a week from Saturday after your hot Valentine's date with a loved one, live right here on Local 6, we got Gwinnett against the Solar Bears. Bob Mills, the voice of the Solar Bears, believe it or not, he shares the same birthday with me and my mom. Is it weird? And Hank Aaron's birthday. Special day. That is a beautiful You gonna day. be sharing that cake? Yes, I, I brought, oh, <laughs> did, you, did you? Thanks, Ping. Thanks for joining us. We Thanks, hope to see you tomorrow morning. Have a great night. Oh,